At the foot of high mountains, with a wonderful view of the city, and spacious land horses are walking. Here you can find Trotter and Akaltike, Halflinger and Freeze, and Curly Island and American Horse. Also, the legendary Arabian horse Nubian, son of the famous stallion Balaton, also can be found here. He is one of the list of legends of the Arab breed. This is the last son of the horse, which was recognized as the best stallion of the last century all over the world. He was with us, two-time champion of Russia, repeated champion of Europe at the time. His foals are constantly winning show of Arabian horses. We have three foals from him. And here is another legendary handsome Chamberlain. Veteran of Kazakh equestrian sports, winner of many championships and show jumping competitions, a detour of more than 20 countries. He is now retired. But this place is not only famous for its fine horses. Here professionals practice humane treatment of animals, take into account their psychology, do not use the iron equipment. Everything is organized as close to the natural conditions of detention, called paradise in the paddock. We are, of course, very proud that our veterinarian is a member of our team. In fact, it is a young scholar. She translated into Russian, in collaboration with Jamie Jackson, his work Paradise in a Paddock. This is the only system that exists in Kazakhstan and the CIS, the first and only. Paradise in a Paddock it is artificially created trail for horses, where you can meet special shelters where animals can shelter from the sun or inclement weather. Constantly available areas of feeding and mineralization drinkers. During the day, the horse move on to a different ground paths, mostly earthen, but there are areas covered with sand and even gravel sharp. Animals like it very much because they forgot about the problems with hooves and colic, common with traditional content. This pathway operates in Kazakhstan for two years. Specialists from different countries come to see it. A graduate of the Timurazov Moscow Agricultural Academy defended her thesis based on this place. When I started to go everywhere, Netherlands, Europe, Italy, USA, I was surprised by just how much the level of physical fitness of our horses. In general, the level of health of hooves and the content we have are at the highest level. Because few of the horses' institutions can demonstrate such level of careness towards animals. It was a pleasant surprise for me. This Kazakh equestrian club you want to call the land of horses and happy children. Because here people from a very young age understand that we can and need to be friends with the horse. We try to instill in children love for horses, respect, understanding, and you may notice that the horses respond in the same way towards children. You can see that they are interested to braid pigtails, riding, walking side by side, to be with the children, to come up with all sorts of interesting activities. The same thing happens in the training process. When the horse starts to listen to the rider, it begins to train and exercise with interest, which the rider begins to offer the horse. Arena where classes are held with horses, events, competitions and events. Every morning it irrigates the automatic irrigation system to reduce the amount of dust. Construction thermos protects the room from overheating in the summer. Infrared gas heaters turn on when the temperature decreases in winter. The soil is the most important characteristic of the arena. The ground we have complies with all European standards of sports arenas. This is Euro soil with quartz sand. Our quartz sand is brought from Petropavlovsk deposits of quartz sand with a cellulose filler. In addition, under the sand we lay mats for horse, so it will be more comfortable to clinch to the soil base. Author of the project of the equestrian club, Japanese architect Yuji Mai. A very appearance of such a unique place on the Kazakh land is a striking confirmation that our attitude towards horses is very special. And now it's hard to imagine that it all began here with two horses. They were bought for daughters and with one big dream.